This video will demonstrate how to download and install the Ring Central Windows client. It will show you how to log into the client and make and receive phone calls. First, the first step is to go to the Ring Central website. You open your browser. I'm using Chrome. Go to the address bar and type ringcentral.com. Press enter. This will take you to the Ring Central website. Up in the upper right, you'll find a link that says support. Click on it. A su the support page for Ring Central will open. Up at the top, about in the center, is a download link. Click on it. In the center of the page is a button that says download for PC. Click on the button. A dialog box will open asking you to save the Ring Central installation program. I like to put all of my downloads in the downloads folder. Click Save. At the lower left, it will show you the status of the download. When things stop flashing, the download is complete. Click on the button at the lower left. This will start the Ring Central installation program. Be patient as this can take a couple of minutes. Once the installation is complete, you'll see a sign-in page for Ring Central. Click on the sign-in button. In the, sign in the first sign-in field, enter your email address that was used for your account creation. Click the next button. Now enter the password that you were given. Click the Stay Signed In checkbox so that you don't have to log in again. However, don't forget your password. You'll probably need it in the future. It wants you to verify the email address that you used. Click this button down here to send a verification email to your email address. You have a limited amount of time to key the verification code that's in the email address. So be quick about things. Our access code is 751-894. I'm going to key in 751-894. And here I am. In the, email, in the Ring Central client. Dismiss any pop up boxes that you get. 
except for this one. Click Confirm Address Now, and then just click Confirm. Great. So here we are in Ring Central. The first thing we'll do is demonstrate how to receive a phone call. I'm going to click on the phone here, and this brings me into the Ring Central phone application. I can see calls that I've made and calls that I've received. If I want this dial pad to go away, I can click minimize and it'll minimize up here to this little dial pad button. So I'm going to place a phone call to my Ring Central number. Here's what an inbound call looks like. To answer it, click the green answer button. Now I'm talking to the person on the far end who called me. The call timer is here in case you want to know how long you've been on the call. To mute the call, use the mute button. If you want to hang up the call, click the red end call button here and the call is ended. Your call history is here. If I want to call the caller back, it's remembered the phone number that called me. I can hover over the call, click on the phone, and it will dial that number. It's calling that user that just called me. The user has answered, and now I'm talking to them. I can end the call by clicking the end call button. Now I have an outbound call to that same number. If I want to manually dial an outbound call, go to the dial pad button here. That brings up the dial pad. Now I can use my computer's keyboard to enter a number to call. I enter the number and I press enter. It's dialing the number. The called party has answered and I'm talking to them now. To end this call, again, just press the end call button. And that's it. That's really all we have to do to get signed into Ring Central and make and receive calls. If you have any questions, please contact your supervisor. They'll get you support. Thank you.